As followers of Sanatana Dharma world over, gather together to commemorate and celebrate Guru Purnima, a day to honor teachers, mentors, and guides. It is one of the most auspicious festivals of Sanatana Dharma, celebrated mostly in our land, Bharat. In fact, this year, it falls on the 5th of July, which is a Sunday and also a lunar eclipse day. On this day in particular, disciples remember their Guru, teachers and God and pay their gratitude to them for all that they have learned and gained from their respective Gurus and teachers. Though it falls on the Lunar Eclipse Day, a point to be noted here is that this year the Grahana or the Solar or Lunar Eclipse will not be seen or visible in Bharat. In fact, this day, disciples remember their Guru word, which is the word for Sans in Sanskrit for teachers, for one simple thing. For all that they have learned, gained through the teachings or the experiences from their Guru. It is from ancient times that the Guru Shishya Parampara has been held in high esteem and respect in our land. The Guru occupies a very important place in Indian society. Much before the advent of Western style education, Disciples took to the Gurukulas to complete their education wherein they learned the value of knowledge and discipline from their Gurus. They not only studied there but also stayed there and through their growing up years learned many a skill which came useful to them later on in their lives. Ancient scriptures like the Mahabharata and Ramayana are filled with instances of the special bond between a teacher and his disciple, or a guru and his shishya. How can one ever forget the Sandipani school where Krishna studied with Balarama and his great friend Sudhama in the Sandipani ashram? It is also a significant festival for the Buddhists. It is believed that Lord Buddha, who gave up his kingdom and throne in, seek, or in seeking moksha, first gave his sermon on this day which is now known to the Buddhists as Buddha Purnima. It is believed that the writer of the great epic Mahabharata, the saint Vyasa was also born on this day and hence it is also known as Vyasa Purnima. The Purnima Tithi starts at 11.33 in the morning and ends at 10.13 on 5th July. The Purnima Tithi starts on 11.33 at 11.33 a.m. on July 4th. The Purnima Tithi starts at 11.33 a.m. on July 4th and ends at 10.13 in the morning on July 5th. Whilst wishing each and every one a very happy Guru Purnima, I am confident that the ancient reverence and place of the Gurus will re-emerge in today's society in our fast modern day world and we will walk this new journey from now on with a lot of learning and reverence to the Guru and learnings from the Guru to us in our land Bharat. Om Shri Krishna Nama, Om Shri Ramadra Nama.